Look at this, isn't this absolutely stunning? Just this explosion of color around after the rain. Now there's a couple of different species here. Oh, so pretty, pretty. Now the trick is knowing which one to go for, Brian. Hmm. Mm. Let's just go for that one. <laughs> I think it's there. Um, oh no. So the yellow ones that you see flitting about are called uh, broad banded grass yellows, but I'm trying to show you a painted lady, but I can't see where it is now. There's an African monarchs, there's some window acreas, there's spotted acrea, and there's some v oh, sulfur tips. There's a yellow pansy or two. What do we got there now? That is a monarch butterfly, the African monarch. Okay, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I do love the flutterbys. Now, okay, from that monarch, Brian, come down towards us. Oh, I think you got him. Is that the painted lady? No, that is an acrea. Now I need to open your wings to show me which acrea you, ooh. Oh, I've forgotten this one now. Oh, it's the one, garden acrea. The one without too many spots on its wings. Now if we come towards us, Brian, I see where that acrea, where is that acrea now flashing its wings? It's in, in the shade just here, I think. You see there's a, it's got its wings closed at the moment. A little bit to the left. There we go. There is a painted lady. Let's wait for her to open her wings. And it's got exquisite coloration on the inside of her wings. Come on, painted lady. Come on, open those wings. There's a monarch with her. Uh, you can see, and she's got quite dull coloration on the outside of her wings. So it's to help her camouflage. So she's obviously, oh, where did you go, painted lady? Not poisonous. I think she's there. There she is. Come on, just one open of flap of the wing to show us how beautiful you are on the inside, not the out. And where are a couple of them around? Oh, she's being too quick today. I'm gonna have to find one that's a little bit better. And there's a diadem, the black and white one. A male diadem. Where's he? He's there. Where's he gone now? We got him. Oh, no, there's a white. Ah, to the left slightly, Brian. Keep coming. Where? I think I'm in the wrong patch. Where? You see the black and white one? Quite a big butterfly. And I'll get... Where am I looking? Am I looking in the wrong place, Brian? I'm going nuts. There we go. I thought we were on a completely different patch of flowers. There we go. There's the diadem. The male diadem. Now, one of the more common butterflies, oh, he's so pretty, that we're seeing amongst this hive of activity is, of course, the little grass yellows. And, uh, oh, he's having a hungry butterfly. Very, very beautiful. Now, the female diadem, oh, off it goes, mimics uh, the monarch. Now, let's try to find one of these little yellows. So, oh. Someone was asking, Bush Mom wanted to know wanted to know the difference between a broad bordered grass yellow and a broad or banded. Well, they're, they're the same. They're exactly the same. Uh, there's no difference whatsoever between between them. I think uh, with a lot of butterflies, there's actually multiple names for them, and it can be very confusing. Oh, there's a painted lady out in the open now. Now, I got so excited about being surrounded by butterflies that I forgot to introduce myself. Hi, I'm Brent, and I've got my cameraman, Brian, and his thumb is going old school all the way back to bedrock today. So, the caveman thumb, and uh, we're going to go look for some leopards now. So, while we do that,